Well, good morning, everybody. Happy time with the bear. Yeah. Just a little simple update. Uh, I'll be looking over here a little bit because I got them. Um, <laughs> not sure what I'm going to say. I am, uh, since I haven't been driving around a lot, my batteries are a little low. Um, and I've decided to, it's been over a week now, I've decided to go back to Port Oak Cove get plugged in for a couple of nights, get my batteries really charged. I have to pay attention on how long I stay in one spot and I gotta drive around, but I figure doing it this way at $25 a night or, tw yeah, $25, doing it this way, it's a lot easier than driving around and spending all that gas money. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna do it like that. So I'm gonna go there, do that, chill, clean up a little bit, make some videos. Uh, I'm putting up a video today about my uh, dog bowl oven. I call it that because uh, my my friend Mark, who's a subscriber, that's what they're made of. He bought two dog bowls, put them together. Anyways, I'll show you a little bit more about that. Uh, yeah, I told you about my batteries. I want to top them up. And uh, I got pictures I mean, I did a video yesterday, so I got some pictures, and yeah, I'll just do a few shots of stuff. Uh, I have a buddy uh, that's up that end, he might drop by, Brent. Uh, he's from the island, well, he, I met him on the road a few times, but he's hes on the island now, and then he came over for Emmy's meet and greet, and uh, yeah, so he might, he might pop in with his uh, buddy he met from Ontario called Scott. Uh, so, yeah. yeah. Things have been getting done here. Uh, yeah, I just decided to, uh, yeah, this need some time, you know, gather my thoughts and stuff and do a little bit of exploring. I don't mean exploring, walking around, because I'm really having a hard time lately, to be quite honest. But uh, I got my pills. I got everything I need. I think my blood pressure's slowly coming down, so that's all good. Um... Anyway, so, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Uh, maybe get, I got lots of things I can do. Maybe take some time to paint. Maybe take some time to carve. I don't know. I just know that, you know, I got to do what I got to do. And uh, getting out of Dodge here seems to be a good good idea. So, uh, on that note, oh, I also don't mind the hair, okay? The hair is a little messy, but I'm looking for one of these. Cape Breton. Now, this might be, uh, you know, might only come out at a certain time of year or something, but I found this in Nova Scotia at one of them, uh, you know, souvenir shop type deals. If anyone from that part of the country sees one of these, if you could please just take the information, uh, where I can sort of like phone them, talk to them, or order one, because I really like to replace this one. Because this one, I can only wear it so much, it's starting to fall off my head, and it's, this has been washed, and it is clean, relatively. <laughs> so if you can, I'd appreciate it. Thank you. Till the next time, I'll talk to you soon. called the dog bowl oven a subscriber of mine who follows me anyways yep the name is mark he said he said i th i think he i believe he found this on youtube somewhere i could never find this anyways he showed me how to make an oven well he actually brought all this stuff for me these two things here, they got little cuts in them. Sorry, my hands are hard to move sometimes. Little cuts in them, you put them together. Simple as that. This is the bottom one. Try to put that in the center. And 
You put this on top. And these clips, there ain't the ones he bought me, but I seem to misplace them somewhere in the front somewhere. Anyways, I had these ones that I found. So we're going to use that. Anyways. Anyways, for now, sorry it's a little banged up it looks like, but I bought this. I bought this at uh, Save On Foods and they come heated. They're already pre-cooked, so, and uh, yeah. So I really like these. They don't have a bottom on them, so I think this would be a good place to put it because the heat, you're not gonna touch nothing. So yeah, so. Uh, <laughs> You put this pot pie, which is on a cardboard, sorry, which is on a cardboard, uh, in a cardboard thing here. You put the pot pie on the X like this. I'm not going to use water or nothing else because I guess I want to dry it out and heat it at the same time. Then you take your, your other dog dish. And try to get it center. You make, you put the clips on like that. Like that. And like this. Then you turn on your stove. You turn on your stove and you bring it down to as low as you can go. That's about as low as I can go. And now we wait. Put the timer on about 20, 25 minutes. Uh, and yeah, hopefully that'll be all right. Yeah, 25 minutes. We'll check it out then and I'll get back to you and we'll see how, how it is, if it's warm or how it worked out. This is the second time using this, so. I mean, my friend Mark, he said it works good. He's done it. I'm just checking it out to see, yep. Uh, yeah, there's other little parts you could do in this too, so. For now, I'll just show you this and then we'll try to do something later. Okay, I'll get back to you. Okay, well, it's been 25 minutes. I use the dish towel to take it off. I would also suggest that you use something to take these clips off. Because they get, you know, they get quite hot. Well, this is like the first time I tried this, like other than a, a muffin the other day, but yep. It doesn't look burnt, but seems a little dry, so. Anyways.
hot enough. It looks okay. But we'll see if it's cooked on the inside. I'm just going to put a little shot of salt. And we'll see how this tastes. Yep, well, it's a little soft on top, like, I mean, you know, it's not like hard, but warm inside, so I think we passed the taste test. My friend did send along different ideas. He sent along a couple of these little tin things with holes in them, as you can see. Toothpicks to make the holes. He also sent another one like this, so you can flip it upside down if you don't want to use them crossbars in there. And he sent a big one like this, so, I mean, that would go all the way around or he could put something in it. And some of these pot pies, not this one, but the older ones, I guess, or I don't know if they still make them that way, came with little metal, you know, little little metal things. So that will also help heat up, heat up whatever you're trying to bake in the oven. Uh, this is just like, I didn't show you the first one I did with a muffin, but I will show you again. I put some water in the, in the muffin uh make it a little steamy but it just made it moist but inside was cooked this one was just flat and uh it left a little cross on the bottom of it from the heat so it gets quite hot i guess uh i'm gonna try it again with uh, another one of these little pans and i'm gonna try to bake a muffin and we'll see how that that was 25 minutes. If you want it steaming hot, you might have to go a little bit higher, but 25 minutes, there you go. Okay, on that note, that's it for now. Take care of yourselves. I love you. Next time on Jeffy Sheffy Bear. <laughs> Thank you.